the late Mrs. Mkwelela Kudiras Makpaderun has been described as an epitome of beauty and embedment of knowledge. Mrs. Makpaderun, who passed away on January 18, 2024, at the age of 90, was born on June 19, 1933, in Lagos State. In her prime, she entered into matrimony with Prince Muyosore Babajiri Makpaderun, and their union was blessed with five children, grandchildren, and great grandchildren. During the service of songs, Various choral groups delivered heartfelt renditions as a tribute to her memory. Attendees at the Christian Waykeep reflected on Mrs. Makpaderun's life, highlighting her virtues and contributions. We know her mother to be a very strong woman. She may not know much of the scriptures, but the one that just in her heart, when she holds on to it, you will know that this one, she has gotten it. And she's a woman of faith. She's a woman of faith that was able to pass her faith across to other younger women in the church. The minister, delivering words of exhortation, emphasized the importance of running the Evelyn race and leaving a legacy of greatness on head. Why we celebrate Mama today? For me and for you, the word of God is everyone has appointment with death. Everyone. Among those who spoke were her children, Prince Adefemi Makpaderun, Adela and Prince Adelibigbe Makpaderun, who fondly described their mother as a nurturing figure, filled with love, discipline. A mother in a million. She was everything to me. She looked after me and uh, she gave her best to me and to my siblings. And one thing I can say about her is that she was a hard-working woman, and we had to take that from her. She never discriminated. While growing up, we had house helps, but it's not for us to be in bed at 4 p.m. because the house helps will wake up by 4 p.m., by 4 a.m., and so we also had to get up by 4 a.m. She imbibed that in us, she disciplined us, so that that is what some of the things we are going through in life today. She was a strict timekeeper. Strict timekeeper. She never joked with time. Mama is more like a mother to me, a mother to the world. She is always there to nurture people. So what else do you want to know about that? That you don't go into her house and come out with empty stomach. You, she will make sure she feeds you. She natural, natural. She nurtures people, and she's always open to taking new people. Warm hearted, but I don't know what matters. Sometimes it's painful to see her exit, but she's done her best. We were together the night yet bad day, and uh, we didn't know she was going now. She's done well. She was a very caring mother, very loving. She did everything possible with my late dad to give us uh, a worthy life. She was industrious hard-working and uh, God-fearing woman when she was alive. The grandchildren also shared memories of their late grandmother, offering glimpses into her warmth and wisdom. Grandmother, she's um, a fantastic person, a very good cook, no nonsense, and very, very meticulous. Mama lived well. She was loving, caring, and amazing, elegant, and also disciplined. She carried herself with grace, and I'm really going to meet her. Relatives of Mrs. Makpaderun shared moments reflecting about her impact and presence in their lives. The children look after her, and she enjoyed herself. She's a very, she was a very adroit woman, very industrious, and she brought so many people up after her that she, you know, to them was there under her that they are. Just having their own business like that. The funeral service was marked by entertainment of guests and musical performances commemorating the life of Mrs. Mukulela Kudirat Makpaderu and the indelible mark she left on all those who had the privilege of knowing her. Mm -hmm.